Open Champ, it is Ethan Bennett. My man, congratulations. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Okay, talk me through. Let's go back to yesterday. Yeah. So 67 on the card yesterday. Talk me through that round a little bit. Um, it was really steady to start off. Uh, I think I only made the turn in one under. And then starting on 12, I kind of made a bit of a run. I chipped in on 12 for Eagle. Just played really consistent the rest of the way. I birdied uh, 16 and then made a long one on 18 to come in at five under. So I needed it after the first round. I didn't play my best. Uh, came in 76, 40 on the front, really sloppy. But, you know, I was really happy to make up for that yesterday and then played really solid today. I mean, Isaiah kind of pushed me to my limit. Sure. It, it, I mean, yeah. heck, mo most of the time, like I know from previous years and from what I've heard from Adam, if you're six, seven over, that's a good club championship yep. should put you right up there and i mean isaiah was two over for three rounds i was two under it's just a real duel the whole way i'm super proud of how well he's played in his development so um also big thanks to aldo of course is in great shape it's pristine every year um thanks to adam i mean i've worked with him for the last couple of years and helped to kind of keep me in shape so big thanks to everyone around the whole lookout point family and uh just couldn't be happier well said my man thank you um so last night you're sleeping on a three shot lead what'd yeah. you what'd you do to prepare for today um well i'll be honest like I, I i wasn't super comfortable the last few times whether it's been in college or other events where i've been sleeping on a lead it hasn't really gone my way um the next day uh and so i just you know tried to keep my mind off it and focus on other things watch some olympics yeah um just tried to think that you know if i go out tomorrow play the best i can and try and keep it you know think about it like it's a one round tournament and where everybody's starting even so you know isaiah was ahead of me like from the second hole onward and so i was thinking okay i'm one shot behind i'm two shots behind whatever it was i'm just stuck with that mentality the whole time okay my toughest question for you yeah now that we're going to have bennett bennett parking spots next year yes. for our men's and women's open champion yeah. who gets the first parking spot i i think it's me i'm the oldest <laughs> I think that's a fair answer. Ethan, so proud of you, my man. Congrats. You're an amazing representative for Lookout Point. It means a lot. Really appreciate well it. Well done, man. Thank you. Well done. Peyton, congratulations. Thank you. This is Peyton Bennett, our ladies' open champion. Now, I only got one question for you. If you hold that trophy and you look through some of the names on there, you're going to see Marlene Stewart Street. Ann Sharp, Kathy Shirk, legends in Canadian female golf. How does it feel to add your name to that trophy? It's unbelievable. I, I can't believe some of these names and you know, mine's gonna be right there beside some amazing names and they've played here and they've played this same hard, difficult golf course and we all played it and we won. <laughs> awesome, awesome playing all weekend. You're a great representative for Lookout Point. Uh, appreciate everything you do. Any comments for the field, for the how, the golf course, or oh, anything for the weekend? To Aldo and his team, just amazing, beautiful. Even after all the rain we had yesterday, perfect conditions today. Beautiful day for our last day. It was amazing. Awesome. Thanks. Congrats. Good playing, Thank Peyton. you. Men's A Flight Champion, Pete Doyle. How are you feeling, dude? I feel amazing. <laughs> take me through the end. So we had a playoff. Uh, take me through that final hole. That was uh, some pretty special. Yeah, I had the uh, I had the first tee shot, and I put it in the trees right, so I knew it was going to be in trouble. And uh, Ryan put it in the fairway, but farther back, so he knocked it on. Had about 30 feet left for birdie. Um, I thought I hit a good punch out, but I got held up in the rough, so I was left with about 40 yards. I was trying to bump it up close, and uh, it went in. <laughs> so yeah. Awesome, man. Well done. Uh, super proud of you. Proud to have you as our A-Flight champion. Um, any words for the ground screw, the course, the rest of the competitors in the field today? Oh, yeah, the course is amazing. Um, yeah, thanks to the Pro Shop for a great tournament. And uh, love playing here. Awesome, man. Congrats again, Pete. Thanks. I am here with our ladies A-Flight champion, Sharon Montgomery Greenwood. Congrats, Sharon. Thank you very much, Dan. Appreciate it. So take me through the round today. Well, I think the goal today for me was to really just um, do one shot at a time and keep my head in my cart and in to myself. <laughs> and I accomplished that. I just had one little fum, you know, stumble uh, on the back nine, but other than that, eh, you know, it was good. I was my playing partners were exceptional, which was so fun. We really yes. enjoyed our round two. Yeah. And um, that's all part of what we do here, social. And, and the course today, even with the sand traps was just 
fantastic. It was great, wasn't it? Was, it was, yes. It was. Yeah. Well, congrats again. Thank you, Dan. Proud to have you as our A-Flight champion. Thanks. We look forward to uh, next year defending the title. Yeah. Thank you, man. Awesome. Appreciate it. Well done, Sherry. Okay, thanks. All right, here with Brent Lambrex, B-Flight champion. How's it feel? Uh, it's now good now that it's over with. <laughs> we got a little nervous out there. Terry put a rush on, or a pretty good charge on the end, but uh, it's a lot of fun. So, here, so here's the question. Last night, at home, six-shot lead. How'd you prepare for today? I tried to, <laughs> <laughs> tried to go to bed early and not get ahead of myself too much. Nice, good stuff. Congratulations, man. Uh, any comments for the field? Uh, everybody played great today. A few guys that were fantastic. Everybody was great to play with. Awesome. Congratulations. Thank you. Here with Terry Lynn Adamson, our B flight champion. Now, a couple years ago was D flight, then our C flight. This year's B. What are we doing next year? A. A flight. I love it. <laughs> so just take me through the round. Take me through the last hole because there was a little drama there. The last hole was a lot of drama. Uh, my drive was through the trees. Thank goodness it made it through. <laughs> but my second shot was long and up into the long grass up the top of the hill. So I chipped it sideways, chipped it on, and made the putt for five. And my opponent made her, I don't know how long that putt was, but That was she, an incredible putt. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she made a very long putt for a four. And oh, I only beat her by one. Wow, that's fun. That's what it's all about, yeah. right? That's why we do this weekend. So congratulations. Thank you. Um, any final words to the ladies in the group, the ladies section today? The I think the ladies were amazing to pull it off and not one person dropped out yesterday in that torrential rain. That's amazing. How about the golf course? It really played well this weekend? It, it was wet, but it played well. Good. Yes. Congratulations again, Thanks. Terry. Roger Jacklin, our C flight champion. Roger, so one stroke down last night. What was the thought process coming into today? Just play through the day and get through it and keep up with Pete. So talk me through that front nine you were mentioning on our way up. It was pretty entertaining? Yeah, it was solid. Pete played very well. He was 37, I was 38. Just a mano a mano and away we went. It was uh, tied on 13. And I managed to get up a couple coming home and uh, bring it in. Awesome, and congratulations. Thank you. Um, any final words for all the guys in the flight and uh, other competitors today? Thanks for everybody coming out and supporting the club. It, uh, it's nice to see everybody out and playing the championships. Brilliant, thanks again, Raj. Thanks, Dan. Here at Joanne Katina. Joanne, congratulations. Thank you very much, Dan. Can I put this down? Yeah, soon. <laughs> go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> so this is your first club championship victory for you? Yes, it is. Yeah? Yeah, it is. Congratulations. T take me through the round. How was it out there today? Stressful. Yeah? <laughs> um, I didn't think I was going to be nervous, but, you know, you try to you get in your head and you kind of say, get over yourself because, like I said, it's just recreational golf. Someone sunk a great putt. No, the, yeah. The but you know what? It's a lot of fun, and I would really encourage other women because there's really great golfers in the ladies' league to come out and just play. You know, it's just recreational golf and have a good time. Well, thank you so much. Congratulations again. Thank you very much. Any final words for the ladies in your flight and the rest of the ladies section today? You know something, the ladies I played with were absolutely awesome. awesome. We had a great time. We really encouraged one another. And to me, that's the spirit of golf. That's, that's what it's right? all about. That's what yeah. it's all about. Well, thank you again very much and congrats. Okay, I am here with our D flight champion, Mr. Danny Greer. Danny, tell me about the round today. How'd it go? It went pretty good today. Actually, I just tried to keep the ball in front of me. I had some real tough competition with John over there and uh, had a lot of fun out there. So, But I just kept the ball in front of me today. Like we ended in a what, four shot victory? It did, yeah. But uh, it was closer than the four shot victory. He left out about five or six times, so it could have been tied or he could have won. But they, that's the way the golf gods go. That's right. Well, congrats. Um, any comments any uh, for the rest of the, your competitors or the uh, um, the staff here in general? Uh, they did an excellent job of keeping this course in really good shape. Sure. With all the rain we had last night, the golf course was fantastic. The greens were good. Uh, they had the course set up fair, and I thought it was in excellent condition. Congrats, Danny. Thank you. I'm here, I'm here with Vince Bellantino, our uh, men's e-flight champion. So Vince, just tell me a little bit about the round today. Well, uh, it was competitive in the, the well, competitive, competitive the, the whole time. Uh, Mike uh, 
took on uh, three strokes in the first nine and then Tiny took another stroke so uh, he needed to gain five but then I sort of rallied and held my ground and ended up winning. <laughs> you said this is one of the first competitive tournaments you've played? Yes and the only tournament I've won, won and probably the only tournament I'm going to win <laughs> but I'm happy. <laughs> well congratulations. Anything to say to the rest of the field or the players or the, even the staff today? Great tournament. Uh, the, uh, the course was in spectacular uh, condition. Spectacular. Dude. And uh, it was just great. We had fun all around. It was a good, good group of guys. Some great playing, Vince. Congrats. Thank you very much.